Hey guys, here's a quick video to show how you can use collaborations within your Canvas course. For this example, I am going to be creating an interactive notebook to use with each one of my students that they'll be able to work on throughout the quarter or semester or year or however you want to set that up. I will say this is a bit of work on the front end, but I think it's worth it in the long run for each of my students to have an interactive notebook to work in. So I'm going to go ahead and show how you can do this. So I'm going to start by clicking on collaborations. And then from here, I'm going to click plus collaboration. You can use either Google or Office 365 for this. I will be using Google. And then from here, you'll actually see a list of all of your students. This is just a demo course for me, so I don't have very many in this course. From here, I'm going to select from my drop down a presentation, but you could do a document or a spreadsheet. And these don't look clickable, but they are. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And I'm going to name this my test student notebook since I will be sharing that with my test student. I could give it a description too if I want, but I'm going to skip that. So now I'm going to select the name of the student I want to share it with. You can add multiple students if you'd like, but for this, obviously, I just want to share it with the one student. And then I'm going to click Submit. From here, it has now created a Google, uh, Google Slides for us to both have access to either through Canvas or it will also show up now uh, when I refresh in my Google Drive as well. So it's both places now. Um, the thing about this though is you have to build it in Canvas. You can't use something that you've already created. So when I click on it, you'll see it is just a blank Google Slides. But I can easily work from a template. So I found this template on uh, Slides Carnival. So I could go ahead now and select all of those slides and then I can use my quick keys to copy them and then just paste them right into that notebook. So now the document that I've shared with my student has that template in it and they can now work on this throughout the quarter, semester, or year. And then I would basically just repeat this process. I would go back into my collaborations, make a new collaboration, and this time I would select a different student to share their notebook with. Uh, hopefully this shows how you could use that collaboration feature to create a notebook. Obviously this isn't something I'm collecting for a grade or that's part of an assignment, but rather just something that they are going to be working on throughout. And I want to be able to pop in and check on that. And collaborations for me is an easy way to do that, but you can decide if that work is worth it for you.